What's poppin' everybody? It's your boy Joey back with more Assassin's Creed Valhalla. In the last episode, we wrapped up the London story arc. Uh, we came back here to Ravensthorpe. We reported our um, our alliance to Hytham and to Ranvi. Uh, after speaking with Hytham, he then told us that there are two places that are infested with the Order of Ancients members. One of which is in a place called Vinland. Um, and in Vinland is uh, Kjotve the Cruel's son, Gorm. So we're going to have to travel to Vinland and kill Gorm. But Vinland has a power level of 160, and we're only like level 93 right now. So it's going to be a little while before we do that. Uh, Hytham also said that there is another place called Jorvik, that is infested with Order of Ancients members, but Jorvik, if I remember correctly, is has a power level of 190. Um, <coughs> Jorvik is um, here. Yeah, Jorvik, power level of 190. So, if I do any of those, I will get shredded, and I'm not trying to get shredded right now. Um, that, that, uh, ooh, what's this? shiny um what else uh we we ran into uh valka she actually traveled here to ravensthorpe and um we have a little hut set up for her um right here that's uh valka's hut and i mentioned in the last episode that there are three story arcs involving valka and those three story arcs are incredibly crucial to the story of this game. Without, If you don't do these story arcs, the ending to the game will be so confusing. And you won't understand what is going on. Um, I think I'm the appropriate level to do the first story arc, but I don't want to do it just yet. Um, I also was curious about this mission right here. Uh, speak to Edith to travel to the Isle of Sky. I did not know what this was, but after looking up some information, I remember what it was, and I have done this mission once before. Um, I am going to wait a little bit before I do it, but it is actually a really interesting mission. It's not really... I want to say it's not really crucial to the story of Valhalla, but it's kind of crucial to the Assassin's Creed franchise in a way. Um, I'm not going to do that one yet, so I'll leave you in suspense and try and figure out what it is. But uh, right now, what I want to do is I want to travel to Oxenifashire and meet with Sigurd. That is my plan. Um, I also have some new skill points. Um, nope, that's not what I want. <gasps> Excuse me. Um, yep. Can I get this? Yes, I can. Gives me another adrenaline slot. Nice. Um, then my next goal. No, not that this yes it is so that's my next um upgrade that i want the background bolts so i'm able to like run at someone pick up a weapon that's off the ground and just chuck it at them so that's what i want to try to get to next but in order to get to that i have to complete this branch here what's this um nah not important uh, if I'm correct, these members here, uh, Firebrand, Jorvik, Jorvik, yeah, like, these, these three characters are all in Jorvik, and it's a power level of 190, so I have, n I'm not gonna be going to Jorvik anytime soon. Location, Ravensthorpe, uh, Edith, um, there was a side mission that I was doing. I don't know if I did it on screen. I might have did it off screen, but I um, 
I ran into one of these guys here. I think it was this one here. Um, there are three soldiers or, or Vikings that were part of uh, Ragnar Lothbrok's army. And uh, what they want now is one final fight. And in that fight, they want to die. Or well, they basically just want to die. They want to die in one final fight. And that's the Viking way. They want to die in battle. So um, you will fight these three Vikings in one final fight, but they are very powerful. I tried to fight this guy here in the center, and I got destroyed. So uh, I might try to fight them later on, but uh, might be some time before I do that. Or I may just not do it at all. We'll see. Um, inventory. Um. <clears throat> Um. Huh. There, I think there are two. There's a few weapons here that I want to upgrade. I want to upgrade this, the House Carl Axe. Um, I'm trying to decide if I want to upgrade this sword here or this one. This one looks pretty cool, but. Uh, I might just upgrade here the the doppelhander, but we'll see. Right now, I want to stick with my short sword and my axe there. But all right, so let's uh, let's travel to Oxenfordshire, which is all the way up here. Fine, and speak with Sigurd. I will do so. Um. Mm. You know what? Let's do a raid. No. So I'll fast travel here, and I'll do that raid, and then we'll meet up with Sigurd. Um Yeah, let's go by the by long ship. Come on. Let the sail out. Sail down. I just hope I don't run into any blockades on my way to this raid. Is this it? Oh, I, I can't be it, right? Oh, no, it is. Yep. Let's go, the Viking. A Viking girl. Viking girl. Yep. Yeah. Alright, so I just need to focus on the uh, supplies that I need to loot. I still want the upgrade to um, my harpoon attack because I get. Do I have that ability yet? I don't know. Because um, there was something in particular I said before that uh, with the harpoon attack you're, you're able, able to pull your enemies towards you and chop off their head, but I don't have that part yet. So it's gonna be a. It's gonna be a hot minute before I get that. Will I now? Don't worry, I got the money, I'll pay. 
I'm kidding. My uh, Avor's pretty broke. What the hell was that? that was oh, I know what that was. Ah, that's that's what it was. So, oh right, it's the ability where someone like throws something at me, whether it's a javelin or an arrow, I can catch it and fire it back at them. So go ahead, shoot me with something. I dare you. Ah, I missed. I missed again. Shit. Come on. No, I I did it. Friggin' nutsack. Yeah. What did you say? Ah, crap, I did it. I, I timed it wrong. It's gonna take a minute or two to try and get this right. There we go. Nice. Well, that's kind of pointless anyway. I can just aim like this and shoot him. Haha. -ha. Okay, this is annoying. Completely missed. Whatever. You know what? You know what? They're not the priority. I need to raid everything here. There. Die. Hey, he's my kill. I got this one. Just shove that down into your stomach. Good god. Um. Okay, never mind. Hey, come here! Come on, give me a hand real quick. Thanks. But I finally got my uh, fourth adrenaline slot, which is good. I think the uh, I think you're only allowed four adrenaline slots, actually. I mean, I could be wrong. Hey, can you not click? Can you not like, please? Friggin' just. Oh my god. What is this shite? My god. All of this nonsense. Um that's that's is this blocked off? Yeah, it's blocked. There's gotta be another way in though. Those uh windows are separated by a by a beam, so I can't get through that way. What about here? No, it's blocked as well. Is there a way up top? Wait. Wait. No. Hmm. Do I need a... No, I don't think I need a key. It's blocked by a piece of wood, so I can't get in through that way. There has to be another way in. Wait a second. Aha! There we go. Nice. Ah! Catch! Oh, there's another guy. Shut a couple of those at you. Do that. And there you go. That's a beautiful wall, by the way. I mean, I wanted to see him kill him, but, you know, a nice wall shot is good as well. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, what was that, Eivor? Uh, need to break d down these doors here so my crew can get inside. They can help me raid this box here. Actually, um, I think you actually come here in a different side mission. <laughs> Excuse me. But, you know, I came here early. Yes, I'm trying to open the chest, but Avoid doesn't want to. There we go. Alright. Two more chests. And then we'll be able to meet up with Sigurd. The raw materials yeah, the raw materials are so much harder to come by. Come on, help me open this. Can you not chew me with arrows? That'd be greatly appreciated, man. Yo, 
Can we get this back to the ship? Oh, sure, just let me open it. There we go. Uh, hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute. Turn around and put your back into it. Or however the song goes, I don't know. I'm pretty sure I just butchered that, but it's not good because I'm, I'm not trying to get copyrighted right now. Haha, <laughs> I just freaking need you right in the head. Uh, where's the other barrel? Ah, it's over there. I see it. I see it clearly now. Oh, shoot, that's one of my guys. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't mean to just freaking slice you across the head there. Yes. There we go. That's what I like to see. Alright. Nice. Raid completed. Um. Although I see something shining in front of me there. You know me, I can never resist anything shiny. Come on. Oh, you stupid horse. I hope it's an ingot. I could really use a few of those. I don't have to spend my money on them back at the settlement. Come on, bro. Pick up the pace. Thank you. Couple wolves howling away. <laughs> Those wolves try to just jump in the water. If they did, if they did, that's kind of funny. They would have just killed themselves. Linforda? What? It's here. Yes, there is ingots. Nice. Seems to be under underground, though. Ah, oh, you fucker! Come on! Ah! Hey, no smoke bombs. No throwing dirt, you coward. Okay. Take like that. Ugh. Just stomp your brain in. Is there something down in here? Some supplies. Those are always, always good. good. Some more money. Money is so hard to come by in this game. Like the only, the only way you can actually get money is if you sell like all your stuff, and even then, it's very little what you gain. But, you know, I'm here again in, uh, Oxenifashire, and there's plenty of things for me to loot, and I can't, can't just, just, I can't just ignore it. What kind of, what kind of person would I be? I'll meet up with you soon, Sigurd. Just, uh, hold your horses there, brother. Ooh, there's also a synchronization point. That would be very helpful along the way. Stamina and the horse gave up. I think there's an ability, well, not really an ability, but I'm pretty sure I can purchase an ability at, um, back at the stables in uh, Ravensthorpe. I think there's an ability that will boost the stamina of your, uh, of your horse. I should take that into account. I should take a look at it next time in Ravensthorpe. But for now, we're just working with what we have. Yeah, there you go.
Man, the viewpoints in this game just look absolutely beautiful. That's one of the amazing things about uh, Assassin's Creed. Whenever you do a synchronization spot, the friggin' view is just insane. Absolutely breathtaking. Like, if I ever traveled to anywhere in the world that was, like, referenced or a country that was used in Assassin's Creed, I am just going to be looking around for all the landmarks from what I know of the game. I was like, oh yeah, I remember that, I jumped off there, I'm like, oh, I killed that guy here, and I'll just be looking around for all the landmarks. Uh, but it would be pretty cool. Oh, see some ingot. And I think I'm gonna, wait! Oh dear god! Oh shit, okay, you know what, let's do it. Let's do this right now. I'm not afraid, let's go. This was completely by accident, but here we are, let's do it. So this is actually another one of those le legendary animals, like the uh, giant, uh... Oh god! Ah! No, 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 no! But yeah, like, these are another, another of the legendary animals that uh, Wallace wants you to kill. Oh god! Um... Oh my god, this is insane! I just like, came across this by accident, and I had no idea it was here. Oh, careful now. <sighs> Gotta be careful. Ah, damn it, get off, you little shit. I'm not giving up. Uh-uh. Get off! Get off, get off me! No! Bad! Ah! Get off, you little bastard! Keep the other three in sight. Enough of your howling shit. Excuse me! Oh, get off! You fucking head. Ah. I am not gonna lose. I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up. Oh my god, this is insane. You fucker. Get off. Ah, no, 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 come on, come on. Ah, damn it. Are you fucking... I know. So I'm gonna die. I'm flat out going to die. There's three of them. They're only down to half. I have no more rations. I'm going to die. This is such shit. You better back the fuck off me. Wait, wait, wait. Yes, come on. Okay. One down. Come on, come on, come on. I can, I can still do this. I can do this. No. Come on, come on. You better back the fuck off. Uh-uh. Absolutely not. Are you trying to heal? No healing. We're not about that. We're not about that here. Fucking ass off me. You better back up. No. Oh, come on. Damn it, come on. Yes. Come on. Right in the side. Come on. 
Hold still. Yes, come on. Yes, get shit it on. We're not done. We are so not done. We are so close. We're not giving up. Absolutely not. We're too close. We are too fucking close. Gotta be something nearby. Some kind of arrows, ammunition, not ammunition, but like arrows or health or something. I saw I saw a mushroom patch not too not too far. Berries, those are good. Arrows. Those. Come on, turn around. Lay him out. Oh, get get off, off me! No 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 no. We're not we're not dying. We are not dying. Not right here. We're too close. Yes! Ha! Get destroyed. Completely by accident. Came across this place without even thinking. Nice. <laughs> I almost died there. That was close. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> Completely by accident, but I freaking found it. And I pulled through. Alright. Now let's try to find those ingots, wherever the hell they are. Um, no, it's not there. It was a set of steps that led this way. Oh, and there's a key. I think I might need that key to unlock the chest. steps though steps or a tunnel of some kind mm. ah okay this may not lead me to the right spot but I will Look for it nonetheless. Was that it? Come on. It's crap. How the hell am I supposed to get that ingot? I'm not giving up. There, ha there is a way to get it. Do I have to go into one of these houses or something? Like, like what do I do? Maybe I gotta go into one of the houses. Something to uh, need something to blow it up. And I just just so happen to have something. Man, that fire arrow ability comes in clutch so many times. Without it, I wouldn't be able to open a lot of the places that I travel to. Hey, food! I could definitely use some of that. Fighting those big ass wolves. All right. Uh, Sigurd, I think. I think I can meet up with you now, buddy. And there just so happens to be another uh, gold dot right where Sigurd is. So I'm gonna get that last thing, and then we'll 
Go talk to Sigurd. Says that he's in an ale house. So, oh, and then there's a, a drinking competition, and you know I can never resist those. Won't be gentle if they spot me. Oh my God! I just get here, and everyone's like, "Oh my God, who is this guy? He's gonna kill us all!" What's your deal? I missed. There we go. Holy crap, did you see that? Except that bridge got in the way. But he friggin' stabbed him with a sword and then just dropped him right out of the friggin' sky there. That was awesome. Alright. Oh my god. More idiots wanna fight. My god, I just got here, man. Can't you just give me a break for five seconds? Can you not? Oh, okay. I see how it is. Alright, cool. You just take that. Anybody else want some? Hmm? You? Haha, <laughs> get shit on. Dude, you saw that? His arm went flying. Give me a dare. Well, you had that coming, didn't you? Together, lads, we have this. Moron. Have your guts out. What do these idiots want? Like, I just... I'm just trying to f find my brother. I'm trying to collect friggin' items. But you guys want to kill me for whatever reason. Like, jeez. Are you kidding me right now? Okay. I don't like you. God, idiots. Everywhere. Absolutely friggin' everywhere. What do you mean the door's locked, my guy? You know what? I don't need no door. Burst in like this. And something else blocks the path. Great. So how the hell do I get in through, through that side? Oh my god. Can you just... Can you stop, please? Like... Oh my god, can you not? For like five seconds. Okay. I am not liking this right now. I'm really not. Where, where the shit? There's a key somewhere. Is it in here? No, but there's money and stuff to steal. That's always good. Um, where the hell's the key? Like I, I literally saw a key like five seconds ago. Is it over here? No, but that's the alehouse where. Um, where Sigurd is. Ah, there's the key. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Can I, uh... Yes, I can. And... Nope. That's where I just was. It's above me. Better be something interesting. Hold up. Hold up, wait a minute. No, it's just a letter. I thought it was something to steal. Hey Bart, you literally grabbed up the ladder like five seconds ago, and now you're struggling. Like, what is your problem, buddy? It's not that hard. Um, pull yourself up. There you go. Good, good on you. Ow, oh, some braces. Or bracers. But, you know, can't complain. Bracers are always good. 
and fun underneath these barrels. Eighteen dollars, nice. Uh, oh my god, more idiots want me dead. For the love of god, god, bud. For the love of god, can you just... Can you not? Like, please. Okay, this is pissing me off. I don't like you. Take that. Okay, um... I have no idea. You know what? Let's do a drinking contest. I need money. I need money for ingots and for, um... And for crafting materials. After this, we'll talk to Sigurd in the ale house. Is that a bottom I'm just gonna skip through all your dialogue because it's all pointless jabber. Alright, how many rounds are we going for? Five? Six? I'm gonna guess five. Four, okay. I can crush four rounds. I don't know what it is, but drinking with the regular cups is so much e easier than drinking from, from the straight horns there. Because only when you're fight not when you're fighting, but when you're in a drinking contest with uh, other Vikings, they use horns. But when you're drinking with the Saxons, they use cups. And drinking with the cups just make it so much shorter to me. But I'm curious as to what the, uh, the Saxons drink, though. Because the Vikings drink mead and ale. But, uh, did the Saxons drink any mead or ale? They normally drink, like, wine and things like that. At least that's what they drank in the show, anyway. It's like, ah! Yeah. Alright, come on then, drink eeky. Let's make your way to Sigurd. Uh, which spot is he in? Um, Sigurd? Brother? Uh, everything's all blurry. I don't know which alehouse he's in. Sigurd! Brother, where are you? Oh, he's over here. Oh my god. Anybody else want some? That's what I thought. Sigurd, you and your brother. Sigurd's not here. Talk to me. Soldiers always leave a bleeding mess. Don't they leave a bleeding mess? You are not welcome here. I've had enough trouble with Danes today. I'm not here to cause trouble. I'm looking for my brother, a large Norseman. It was him what caused the ruckus. Him and that other one, Maria, talking to Thane Giedrich. Then Lady Edwin's soldiers swept in. A fight broke out. Your brother and the tanned fella got away. The tanned soldiers fella. nabbed Giedrich, though. I was sorry to see that. He's well liked in these parts. Which way did my brother go? Hmm. What's it worth to you to find out? I won't kill you. Simple question. Look, Dave, you start a scene or a scuffle, and I'll scream for soldiers. You don't have a tongue to scream with, so tell me where he is. I'm not paying you, I want the money for myself. You seem to respect this man, Giedrich. If he was talking to my brother, it's because he wants what's best for this Shire. Maybe you're a woman who also wants Oxenifor Shire to be free and to decide its own fate. A woman will stand up for her village, and won't be crushed under the boot of oppression. I hope I am. Such a woman would help me find Giedrich's friends. You're right, you are. Your brother and his friend jumped through that window there and scampered off towards the river. It's a good bet they hid in one of them fish houses. Alright. Sigurd. She was talking about the tanned fella. That is uh, Bassam that she's speaking of. So Sigurd and Ben Bassam are somewhere around here. But of course, we got friggin' soldiers and all around. Yo, you see that axe fly though? That was awesome. Ah! I'll just stomp 
you out real quick. Oh, come on in. Ha! Ah. Get, get blocked, you loser. I'll just stomp you your ass out real quick. That stomp comes in great handiness. Handiness? Is that Sounds even a word? Like I don't know. Good spot to hide. Say good. Pass him. Hey, there you two are. Wait. What the hell? Alan was Sahalan, Eivor. We could have caught you to bloody giblets, Wolfkist. Why so unnerved, brother? It's not like you. Half the soldiers of the Shire are hunting us. You must have noticed. Is that why you haven't come home? You're playing hide and fetch with the Mercian soldiers. Your brother's a busy man, Eivor. Weighed down by pressing duties. Good to see you again, Bassam. I wasn't speaking to you. <laughs> I wasn't speaking to you, Bassam. I'll hear Sigurd's answers from Sigurd. Brother. We should be forging alliances. Send this man back to his warren before he leads you astray. Aver, gods above, I'm grateful you've joined us. We have made strides towards an alliance, in fact. A local thane called Gidritz has pledged an oath to me. I've heard of him. The alewife also mentioned a Lady Edwin who commands the soldiers. Why not ally with her? Lady Edwin's husband was the Shire's elderman, until Gudrun's army had its life. Now she's taking up her husband's fight, with the promise of aid from King Alfred of Wessex. Edwin vows revenge on the Danes who stole her husband and her livelihood. From what we know, Alfred is a fearsome king. If Edwin can win his full support, this shire is lost to Wessex. So to fight her, you've pledged your sword to a minor thane who likely commands a gang of farmers and fishermen. Have faith, Eivor. A few hundred Saxons armed with hayforks and billhooks can be terrified. Gods! All men and women, noble or peasant, have within them the seeds of something greater. This is true. Sometimes greater than the average might can fathom. Well, Edwin has Gidrich in shackles now. All your plotting has turned to ash. Not if we act soon. She dragged her prisoners to the Longhouse. With you here, we can mount a surprise strike. If Gidrich is our best chance for an alliance, let's see it done. All right then. Sigurd and uh, Bassan have like a wary look on them. They're not telling me everything, are they? Bassan talked you into something of little reward. Eva, have you lost hope in my Warcraft? I heed Bassan's wisdom, but he follows my lead. Always. He has the look of one who trusts none but himself. Bassan is secretive by nature, but he is wise and forthright. And he has opened my eyes to a magnificent truth. He has promised me a reward so unusual, so incredible, it will shatter your mind to shards. Brother, our bond has the iron heft of a war axe. Do not let Basim and his prophecies of good fortune sway you from our simple goal. Never. Our goal is fixed. We shall soon be the lords of Mercia and all of England. But Basim has a deep insight. He's read wisdom in the lines of my face, and heard the litany of my forefathers, and... Well, there will be time enough for my saga later. Bassam has, uh... planted some ideas into Sigurd's head. Those ideas could be for better or worse, though. We don't really know. Alright, let's reach the Buckingham's longhouse, and, uh... Maybe we'll be able to find Gidrich there? I don't really know. But, uh... It was, was that Lady Edwin, I think her name was? Or Lady Ellsworth? I think it was Edwin. She's been causing trouble for Gidrich as well. Are you with me, Sigurd? Nope, you're not. You're so far behind, you're not even here anymore. Wow, I just freaking took that guy to school. Okay, I don't know. Okay, you take that. Anybody else? Hmm? 
I mean, I don't want to, but if you want to get your ass handed to you, be my guest. Screw you and your civilian casualties. She was in my way. She should have started running the minute I started swinging my axe. Hit me again. See what happens. Mm -mm. Okay. I civilian casualties will result in desynchronization. Really? really? What, makes, what makes you say that? Everyone's a freaking idiot getting in my way. Alright, so well, we're here. You must be anonymous, are you kidding me? I was anonymous. And this freaking dummy pulled out of nowhere. Open the damn door. There you are, Bassam. Help me out, buddy. Sigurd, kill this sweaty fishwife. Stay your blades. This traitor Giedrich will face trial, as will all the treasonous thanes of this shire. You're the traitor, Edwin, calling on Alfred of Wessex, begging for his army. Clap your mead hole, Giedrich. Lapdog of the Danes. You'll sell us out to Wessex. And that poxy ass bastard Alfred. We won't have it. By what right do you command? Yeah, sure. You're not the elderman here, Lady Edwin. Turn around and walk away. We'll leave you be. You heathenish fork tongued Dane. Foul smelling heap, I shit on you all. Lady, choose your next words with care. For you see before you the future master of all England, Sigurd, of the Hungry Raven Clan. Lay down your arms, free my friend here, and kiss my lordly feet. You will not get a second chance. Sigurd, are you cracked? And <laughs> you kiss my rosy red ass, wayface. Don't tempt me with a good time. I've done with this offal. I leave them to you. Flay them alive and tan their flesh for saddles. Oh, really? Well, it seems I'm gonna have to chop your head clean off your shoulders. Excuse me? What kind of mess did you get yourself into? Are you talking to me or Sigurd? If you're talking about me, I didn't do anything. It was Sigurd who was talking to shit. Excuse me. Just take that. Do that. Damn it to hell. The happy escaped. Alright. I love how Aver's just like Sigurd, are you cracked? Dietrich, this is Aver, my stone armed sibling. Well met. That was your plan, Sigurd. To charm the lady with your vague hope of kingship. Prophecy, Aver. Not hope. No time to squabble. Edwin's taken most of the Shire's thanes. She has her way. They'll be dead by supper. Tend your wounds, Giedrich. We'll free your friends. And what of the holy woman, Fulke? You promised us a meeting with her. I did, aye. But it's a fair mystery why you'd want to talk with... Where is with... she? Thane Holt will know. Fulke lives on his lands. But he'll be dead with the rest if you don't stop the trial. Tell us where, and we'll go now. Their lives depend on the speed of your tongue. Southwest of here, halfway to Oxenaforda, at the Leech Vila garrison. Batim, Aver, to horse. All right. Again, Aver, you and I, with blades drawn and hearts ablaze. Who is this Fulke that Basim spoke of? An ally, Aver. A most important ally. A holy woman who trades in prophecy and secret knowledge. That is not the sort of alliance we're looking for, Sigurd. No, it's even better. You cannot imagine what discoveries await. You're speaking strangely, brother. Because I'm alive, Aver. My heart's alight with the fuel of battlefire. Like old times, eh? Yes, Sigurd. 
Like old times. Remember our hunts beyond the Northern Way? Our first big kill was a ten-point deer. We brought it down together. The arrows from our bows like darts of ice. With sharpened chin bones for skinning the beast. You on the right, me on the left. We leapt and struck. We crashed to the ground like a felt tree. Then the bloody struggle. Damn animal bit my hand. Never knew a buck could bite so hard. But I pierced its throat, spilling its life wine into the drifts. That put an end to him. Such tales you siblings tell. It's just <laughs> one of a thousand passing. It was the glorious dawn of our lives. Many siblings. You haven't yet explained who this Fulke woman is. When the time is right, I will. She is the fulcrum of a larger plan. Above conquering England, what larger plan could we need? Patience, Avon. Patience. Fine. Keep your dread secrets, brother. But if this alliance fails, you may take them to your grave. This fever will break once you know the whole truth. I promise. Well, why not tell me what's going on instead of leaving me in the dark? But yeah, Basim was saying that uh, the brothers have many stories to tell. And that is true for many siblings. Just stories on stories about growing up and li living their lives. Ooh, I see some, uh, see some iron ore that needs to be, uh, sh sh shattered. Can you climb up the damn rock, Eivor? What the hell are you doing? Six, man, that's nice. Seven, that's what I like to see. That's what I'm talking about. Four. Alright, um, I, th I think I'm actually going to end the episode off here. It's gone on long enough. So if you enjoyed this episode, make sure to hit the like like button, it really helps out. And if you know anyone that uh, will enjoy this video, make sure to share it with them and tell them to subscribe. If you yourself haven't subscribed already, well then make sure to hit the subscribe button and hit the, the notification bell to know when I'm uploading next. And uh, take a look at some of the other videos on my channel. There's many other Let's Plays from Assassin's Creed, the Batman Arkham series, Deadpool, Thief, Bully, there's plenty of Let's Plays, and they're all fun, and they'll be very enjoying to watch. Once again, I'll say thank you, and I'll see you guys in the next